Hello, everybody, and a good day to you all. Today, I'm talking about Shades of Blue, episode number eight, Good Cop, Bad Cop. In this episode here, you got two things going on. The whole crew is dealing with the death of Saperstein. He's dead, because why didn't that kill him? Yeah. First time he pushed him off the roof, that didn't take. Then the next time he poisoned him. Yeah. And that what took. And now he's dead. Everybody in the crew is dealing with his death. They're mourning the loss of a friend. But they're doing it in certain ways. Because certain people on the crew don't handle it really well. Because they think Saperstein was a, was, a, was a rat. So they treat him as such. But the one who's taken it the most and the hardest is Harley. Because she is the reason why Saperstein is dead. Yeah. She, she sent the FBI over to his house. She made it look like, she made it look like the, he, he's, he, he was working with the, with, with the FBI. So, so everybody thought he was the rat all because of her. He's dead because of her. She was trying to save him from Wozniak by setting him up with the FBI. But all that did was make Wozniak kill him. So now she's dealing with the fact of the loss of her friend. The guilt that she was the reason why he's dead. And she's pissed off at Wisniak for killing him. So now she went that. So now she's done all this emotion that's right now. And then something else happens. Her daughter, Christina, and her boyfriend Manny were in the park with some friends, and some racist cops come and they beat the crap out out, out of Manny because he was trying to protect his girlfriend. So they were scared to go to. See, Christina was scared to go to her mom because well, she was caught. Doing something a little bit illegal, smoking, uh, smoking, smoking some mar mar marijuana. Of course, smoking marijuana. Yeah. So, so they didn't go to her, but they, they went to Wise Neck instead. They told they told Wise Neck what, what happened, and it was, about to, it was about to blow her off until they showed her showed him the footage because she recorded it on the phone. And then that set, sets up a whole another situation. And then you also had the FBI agent, Robert Stahl. He's still being creepy. Yeah. Creepy. Now, I guess on his quest to capture Wozniak and learning all about his crew, somewhere along the line, he fell in love with, with, with Harley. And he became obsessed with her. And I think that's the reason why he, 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 he tagged her in the first place. Because he, in a way, he kind of wants to save her and keep her for himself. But also, he he wants to torture her at the same time too. Because like he has all these feelings for her, but he doesn't know he doesn't know how to handle it. He doesn't know, doesn't know how to deal with it with her. So he treats her like crap, which makes him her retaliate at him in a bad way. Now I don't know if that turns him on or in some kind of weird way that's foreplay for him. But he has a weird creepy, crazy obsession with Harley. Now, I'm surprised his partner hasn't quite picked up on that yet. Because it's quite obvious every time every time they're in the, they're in the room together. Wow. Wow. Now, the one person I still have hope for on this show that I'm hoping that it won't go down the bad, bad road is Michael Loman. So far... He's still the good cop, sort of. But something happens in this episode that makes me think that he's going to start going down that path. And it's a slippery slope, man. It takes one mistake, and next thing you know, it's just like everybody else in the crew. I keep hoping that he doesn't do that. My fingers are crossed for him. Oh, so much. Because he's, he's a good cop, and he has so much potential. I don't want to see a throw in his life to, because, of the, because of the people he's around. Like, oh. But again, good episode. I really enjoyed it a whole lot. Leave your comments down below. Let me know what you thought about this episode of the good, I'm not the good guy, of Shades of Blue. Well, that's all I got to say about that. So give my channel a big old like, thumbs up, boom, and subscribe to my channel and share. I really would appreciate it. So like I always say in my dreams and in real life, I am the Ninja Rabbit. A peace out. A peoples.